Hello and welcome. I am Offer of Mercia and this is Pacific Drive. The demo of Pacific Drive to be exact. Don't forget to like, a comment and subscribe if you enjoy this year content and then really subscribe by pressing that little bell notification so you're notified every single time my content goes live. If you're going to keep up to date with my content related updates then don't forget to follow me on Twitter which can be found in the description below alongside my PayPal link. So if you're particularly generous, drop us a quick query, it'd be very much appreciated. But otherwise, let's get on with this here demo, shall we? So, I'm trying out Pacific Drive, um, the demo, which recently came out, I think, like, a couple days ago. Um, first ever, I think, time doing, like, an episode like this, so it might be a little bit scuffed. I mean, it's not going to be any different from really any other content than is it, then, to be fair. Everything's a bit, bit scuffed with me. Um... So, Pacific Drive, I don't know much about it. I know that it's a survival drive game set in like a post-apocalyptic or alternate plane of existence kind of thing. Uh, someone told me to check it out, so I'm checking it out. So let's just read through. So Pacific Drive, thank you for playing this preview of Pacific Drive. This demo is the introduction of the game and the first story mission. Save game data from this preview will saved save game data. Would it not be saved game data? Whatever. Save game data will not be compatible um, with the release version of this game, so it's not going to be. That's fine. We appreciate your interest in the game, and we hope you enjoy this taste of the Olympic excursion zone. So, okay. Play, click that. I'm not gonna mess about with any of the settings. I'm just gonna jump straight in. I might mess about with some of the settings once we start, but I'm going in blind, so we'll see how it feels. All right. In 1947, the Olympic Peninsula became the staging ground for a promising new technology. As rumors of its utopian creations. Spread. So did stories about overnight evacuations, unsolved disappearances, and something else. In 1955, the government walled off a section of the peninsula to establish the Olympic Exclusion Zone. For 30 years, the zone's borders grew until the government withdrew and sealed every access point. What happened inside was never disclosed. Okay. Is this a story about what happened then? JS Express, form, address, blah blah blah. Why is there a bird? The Olympic Peninsula in 1998. Oh no, this is about after them. Should I play this on... Should I be playing this on con controller? It feels like maybe. Just unravel the controller. Told you, scuffed. Scuffed! That's what I told you. If he's got, I don't even know if he's got a controller support. looking place, isn't it? Okay, never mind, it's just a, a load. It's a nice looking, very nice aesthetic to the game. Hmm. 
Okay. That is a big wall. Whoa. Nice little drift. I was too busy looking at the wall, not in the road. <laughs> So you can't cheat. The, the wipers don't go faster than this. It's fine. Yeah, nice little drive. That wall is impressive. I really do like the um, the pastel aesthetic that this has got going. This car, this the comic aesthetic that this has got going. Like someone crashed into that barrier there. Or maybe it were a rock. Oh. Tunnel. Headlights. I'm barely touching that and it turns really hard sharply. So it's messing with my radio. Warning. High R levels. Facility extremely facility extreme caution advised. Ooh. So down is down on the D pad is um How do I I guess I can't, I've just got to keep doing that. What are further inquiries, blah, blah, blah. Launch construction ahead, periodic volume, warmth, 80 plus decibels, next 50 miles, okay. That's not legible. We're going off-road. This doesn't look like an off-road car, I'm not going to lie. Surprised that the lights are still working after all this time. Are we even in the, um... Ooh. Did you see them rocks just disappear? That's not good. Okay, this is getting starting to get spooky, isn't it? Ooh. Oh, my car's dead. That's unfortunate. That is very unfortunate. Where's my car gone? Is that my tire? Ooh. This is green. Ah. I think my car's a bit worse for wear. Mm, yeah, not gonna lie, I think my car's a bit worse for wear. It's literally just everywhere. <laughs> That looks like the way, I'm not gonna lie. Could I have just gone straight down here then? Hmm. 
Interesting. Okay. Well. There's no about here that I've seen that I can pick up or out. Yeah, I, I anticipated it was going to be. I don't have a flashlight. And I obviously don't have any windscreen wipers on me. A to jump. Why to jump? Interesting. A's kick. RBs interact. Okay. I'll just get used to it. Can't bother to mess about with that. Fact. One thing I do want to change. So that looks and yeah, I don't want to mess about with looks moving in. LB, 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 LB scan object. Screw you then. Oh wow, I can kick like a mule. We have a talking car. Interesting. We have a talking car. Oh, I have to hold it. Anything about it? Can I... Any tools? Who's Francis? I'm missing a door. I don't like that. Obviously an American drive because I'm... Um... The hell? Oh, you have to close. It's to close the door. Kind of sliding like left. Hey, we got a live one. Hey, do you copy? Hello? Can I Hello? answer? They, they, they don't have a transmitter. We won't hear a thing back. All right, fair enough. But if they're stranded, could they mean they're from outside? They're a preacher. Preacher. Oh, breacher. And if we don't get them to safety, this one won't either. That's a good point. Hey, you're in serious danger. Ooh. closing in, and it's gonna scramble you quicker than beef in a blender. You close the shelter is a few miles east. Get there, however you can, and be quick about it. This this sli the car slides like a bar of soap. Yo! Bro! No! I need to put it in dry. I need to... 
I need to remember that. One second. Fuel can. Okay, that's a little bit grim. Interesting. Sprint! Um, where's the fuel? There we go. Do, do, do. I can't look away. I can't do what everyone else does at gas pump when I'm at, at gas pump at petrol station when they're looking around, seeing what everyone else is doing. Can I put you? I can. Interesting. Zoom it. We're off. Is this the stability thing? Ooh, it's tingly. There it is again, that blip on the spectrometer. I've seen that way before, before, but where? No kidding. Could it be? A remnant? That can't be. There hasn't been one in decades. Look at that spectral fingerprint and tell me that doesn't match the remnants exactly. No, no, no. What, what, what we should be looking at is how fast this preacher seems to be moving. Huh. You know, if I didn't know better, I'd say they're going about the speed of a... No way. No way to not tell me. They found a remnant and it's a car this time? Holy cripes! No one's had working wheels in here for ages. Boy, I'm killed to know how a combustion engine's still chugging away out there. Okay, let's not get ahead of ourselves. First, the breacher needs to get to safety. Then we can look into whether that car is a remnant. My lights aren't working. In my heart of hearts, I already know. They're back, baby. I can't tell. Ooh, I'm suffering, Anna. No, thank you. Later, bitch. Come on. You're a bit hard to handle. Poking around in there, but better to face a bad side than let the zone eat you alive. Back to the gate, I'm afraid. Did I just lose a tire? I did. I mean, there's a front door right here. Okay, so I need to, I'm probably going to have to find a key. Can I get in cash register? Nope. Hey, it's a Game Boy. I haven't seen one of them for years. Is this a Commodore 64? No, nah, it looks a bit... It's probably the power on that is the thing. I just want to have a quick check around first. Okay. Ooh. Ah, God. Are we there? Go to the shop. God, it's been great. You've got five seconds to get the hell out before I. Oh, my head. She drunk. Hello, uh, 
Attention! This message is for Dr. Ophelia Turner. We sent the preacher to your garage on um, uh, official zone business. Now, we have it on very good authority that this person is in possession of a remnant, which has taken the form of a car, and, well, uh... Oh. Yeah, on the remnant thing. She's not gonna care. Um, uh, right, like I said, super official zone business. Protocol, uh demands that you keep them alive until we can get them to safety. Now, if you do not comply, I will occupy this broadcast channel with a recitation of the entire collection of poems I've personally written. That's 10 years and 17 volumes and... Tell her that voice, because she's like a nail gun to the skull. <laughs> so, what is it you want? Oh, well, you know, it's been such a long that 300 meter wall out there for fun unless you're one of the unfortunates who got zapped through wait i just remembered i don't give a damn why or how you got here you're trespassing and i'd kindly like you to get the hell out of my zone oh god unfortunately the barrier wall is as fortified against breaches trying to get in as it is against anyone or anything trying to leave. We have to find you a way out. So you might as well start by fixing up that car. Just don't break anything in my shop with those soft hands of yours. <sighs> what? You need help? Well, there's a headset somewhere in the garage. Put it on. Okay, I'll put it on. The diagnostic will tell you what needs fixing up. Eee, I'm all tickety boona. Fix the car. Oh, look at that, I've got a little mini map thingy. What's this? That's interestingly weird. There's a lot of batteries. Okay, that's pointless. Let's try and not slam into anything, shall we? Okay, we're getting the hang of it now. Lovely, lovely. I need to move it a bit further forward, don't I? Yeah. Need to move it a bit further forward. Um, boom, 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 boom. Certain components and equipment that you will install on your car have abilities that need to be activated. You can assign controls to up to four of these using the small panel on the left side of your dashboard. Okay, in-car controls. While in the driver's seat, you can steer, brake, reverse, shift between drive and park. And, of course, turn the ignition key. You can also toggle the radio, headlights, and windscreen, windshield wipers. Should all these fail, honk the horn. Okay. You can remap these controls and change menu. Auto shop. The auto shop is your base of operations. You're safe there, so you can take your time between drives to fix up the car, craft parts, and research new upgrades. Movement and interaction. That's fine. OK. 
Okay, he wants me to do a crude door. A. What the fuck? Crude door, add to your to do list. There we go. Crude door. Why? Okay. There we go. Gather items from the abandoned car behind the garage for your checklist. Search the abandoned car's trunk. You need a pry bar. Um, search the garage. Search the toolbox by the garage door for a pry bar. Okay. Equip. What's this? Transfer. What's that? Duct tape. Duct tape's always good. Hmm. I feel like that's going to bust it. Ooh, it's a fuel tank. What is this? Plastic. Road flyer. Cool. Am I meant to do this? I feel like I'm missing something. Give me all the loot. Give me the loot! Mine, mine, mine. Oh yes, all the loot. Oh, it's gorgeous. I love loot. I need my thing, donor. Go. Do, do, do. Thank you. That'd be a nice little trip elsewhere. And what was that? Did you see that? What was that? Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Oh. 
whatever. Craft a door. No, he over here. Okay. Looking good. Can I close this? Get the repair putty from the locker. The locker, 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 locker. Go. Is that the repair putty? That's a spare tire. What's this? The chemicals. The inventory. Interesting. My door needs it. This is pretty cool. Pretty dang good. Every part, mate. I'm not letting any part go. Un. Oops, I just kicked it. It's wide to jump. I don't even have a. I don't even have one of those. Scan the flat tire. Repair the flat by crafting and using a ceiling kit, or replace the flat with a spare tire found in the locker. Uh. Yeah, I can use my stuff for um, other things kind of open inventory scandalous wheel okay um. oh wait okay equip the mechanics kit go Use mechanic kit on the loose wheel. Okay. <laughs> okay. Ooh. Not looking too bad. What's this? Install cardboard boxes in the trunk. In Britain, they call this area the boot of the car, but they didn't win the War of Independence, did they? Interesting. Now, 300 million Americans are free to call the back storage of their automobiles whatever they like. How's that for humor? Go. Install a stall craft mat into the trunk.
There you go. Oh, <clears throat> there's a little prototype of mine in the garage. The arc device. Hook it up to your car, wherever it'll fit. I mean, there we go. Install arc device in the passenger seat, apparently. Yeah. This beauty won't just be your tour guide. It's your north star and the only way back to safety. Heck, you should consider it the father, son, and holy spirit if you plan on staying alive. Mm -hmm. That's how yep, we will do. To you. Yes, that's my very own invention. I'll tell you more about it if you live long enough to use it. There you go. First aid kit. Get first aid kits from the locker. This locker. Um, store items for your drive in the car trunk. In the car boot. Scrapper, road flare, first aid kit. Okay. How do I... Like that. Alright, oh, I need to do the rest of my um, first aid kits. Go, pick up gear. Pick up the gear blueprint by the front of the garage door. Okay. Ooh, that's fancy. Impact hammer. Use the pump to fuel the tank. Ah, I don't even have to use my own stuff. Cool. Thank you. Align the car with the charging station parking bay. Okay. Look at all these gadgets and gizmos now. Okay. Don't have anything more for me. They must. I must be able to do stuff, right? Is there anything else I can craft? Cause I kind of want to just craft. Impact hammer. What is this? Not every natural resource can be carefully extracted sometimes. Sometimes you need something pneumatically assisted brute for some pneumatically 
Assisted brute force, Jesus. Um, this captive bolt device is ideal for fracturing crystals, dislodging deposits, or just smashing them. I don't have all the stuff. Gear. What has teeth and bite and carbureted engine? A spare tire. I have a feeling that a spare tire would be quite nice. If you're all set, take a look at the projector against the wall. Inductive car charging and resonant coupling clearly have ample application. I'm convinced they are the future of so many devices. I also believe they may be viable in transport. Even heavy industry say Opie's old nose. Okay, well, what, who's Opie? Root planner. Cool. This is the zone. Within these borders, all matter has lost the ability to hold a constant physical state. What that means is the shape, size, and makeup of just about everything constantly changes. A mile of grass can turn into ten miles of swamp in the blink of an eye, and it does. Constantly. Mm. It's caused by something we call instability. We're completely surrounded by it, and once you've watched it chew through entire mountain ranges, you'll understand that you don't want to get anywhere near it. We can only survive in here within pockets of stability. That's what you're standing in now. And that's what you're seeing mapped on the route planner. If we're going to find you a way out of the zone, you'll need to build a new antenna. Until then, you won't be able to detect stabilized routes beyond your immediate area. So, you've got to go hunting for parts, and that means taking a drive. Go on, pick a route. The Oct device in your car will then show you where you need to go. Off you go. Make a left out of the garage and follow the access road. I guess that's... I mean, that's really the only... Way I can go. I really feel like a spare tire would be quite useful. Impact hammer. Okay, so there's fuel in these as well. It's good to know. Hands. <laughs> sure. Let's actually have a quick check of the roof once again. Because there might be something up here. Check these boxes. Can you check boxes? Nope. There's nothing in them anywhere. No, like there's anything up here. I didn't think. I didn't think there was from the first time we went. Up there. Man to check. What are you, by the way? Interesting. Can't really do it with it. I'm guessing this is a. Arc device. Riding shotgun. That's different. That's an impact hammer. Um, doesn't look like 
Didn't want to miss any of that. It's actually... Ooh. That's a lot to read. Beautiful. Give me. Nothing in the app I'm going to be able to scrap, I don't think. I think this, whatever this is, is going to come into play later in the story. Just from looking at it, it looks kind of important. You know, just got one of those feels. Look at me, I'm important feels. There was a few things that needed um, copper and everything, wasn't there? Yeah, so there's a quick thing that you can use as well. A new pry bar wouldn't, yeah, would be quite handy. Crude bumper. Let's go. Bumper. In theory, any old piece of metal could help brace a car against collisions, and this indeed is certainly any old piece of metal. It's all a bit disposable, so don't get too attached. It certainly isn't. Fair enough. Interesting. Is there a limit on what I can craft here. It doesn't feel like it. No, oh, hang on. Battery jumper. Carbureted engine needs the copper wire. Headlight needs the copper wire. What's this? Gear. Gear, gear, gear. Nothing that I have currently needs a gear. So I don't have all my... Um, I must not have all my available crafting. Yeah, you can just see like there's no utilities, no battery stuff, fuel, light, lights. Oh yeah. Spare tire. I could, I could always just craft a spare tire if I need one. Now that I've got the um, thing, I would really like a door, a back door. Get in the car. Well. There we go. Where we go? Little bitch. My car's all like spandangled, fandango, isn't it? I don't know. And some night, night rider is it? Night rider. And we're off. We're off to the races. What? Am I not driving the entire way there? Oh, I'm, oh, okay. That's a bit of a shame. I would have liked to have drove the entire way there. You know, and it'd just be like 
needs me to do some stuff every time. Okay, newbie. I'll keep this simple. Don't want to overwhelm that little brain of yours. You'll need a few things to rebuild the antenna at the garage. First on the list is plasma. The woods are littered with plasma generators. Look for a research trailer or a spark tower. That's those antenna things zapping you when you get too close. Both are always accompanied by plasma generators. Come on, we're going downhill, surely. Ah. Uh, I don't know if you... I, I was just going to... I was just seeing if I could save petrol then. So I don't need to accelerate down. But yeah, I don't know. That's, that's kind of cheese that it doesn't let you do that. Not any normal car it would let you... Device is picking up on some plasma generators nearby. Your headset has a built in scanner. Use it on the plasma generator and it'll figure out the tools you need. The hell? Okay. Okay. Find and scan a plasma generator. Is this not a plasma generator? It is. It just wasn't impact hammer. Looks like it's ripe for the picking. Can't get at it with your hands, though. An impact hammer will do the trick. Thank you. Obviously, just collect everything. Little little loot goblin. Okay, spy container. Whatever that thing is is annoying. Look at you out in the zone all on your own. They grow so fast, don't they? And I'll be back at the helm. Been a long time, old gal. Didn't think we'd, uh, talk again after that whole Sasquatch incident. Yes, I was hoping to go another decade without hearing your voice again. What did you finally talk Francis to death? Hello to you too, Oppie. And no, I'm still here. Hmm. Handvac. I don't know what that thing is, but it looks scary. Hmm. There's a bin there. I need a scrapper. Why would I need a scrapper for a backpack? Rece no, I wanted to look what the receiver is. This seems this menu seems buggy. I mean it is a demo, so it's like whatever, but it's not even there.
Lamp computer. Lab computer, that'd be quite nice, wouldn't it? I was like a lab, I was like a computer. Hey, uh, uh, driver, I bet you're dying to hear all about the remnants by now. Oh, can you not? I'm a little busy trying to keep them alive. I'll keep to the basics, I promise. They deserve to know what they're getting into. Fine. I'm giving you 60 seconds. That is not nearly enough time to get... 55 seconds and counting. Okay, okay, okay. The remnants, in short, they're old objects that do all sorts of weird things. They bind themselves to people, and, and you're the latest victim. You and the car are inseparable now, so, so get acquainted. Once the remnant is bound to someone, they become gradually more obsessed with it. It takes over the victim's mind until they go crazy and run off into the zone with it. No one has ever been able to resist its siren call. That fixation is probably worming its way into your brain as we speak. This is the first time we've ever got our hands on one. Uh, but we know all about the past remnants, and oh gosh, this one time it materialized as an old copper kettle, and the tea that came out of that thing, it was... And now I'm splitting the transmissions going to your receiver. Anything critical to your immediate needs will broadcast directly and immediately to your radio and headset. Anything not mission critical will be on a low priority frequency. Those transmissions will be recorded and indexed for you to listen to at your leisure. And by low priority, I mean just about everything that comes out of Tobias's mouth. Okay, fair enough. He doesn't. It does sound like he's a bit of um, a chatterbox. Then he just talks about anything. Oh, a locker. Good thing we had another look in here. Let's go drop off some of our stuff again. I have a feeling I can't be seen by that thing. Let's wait for it to start going back. And we'll wait for it to come um, go back over that way. So it seems like it spends quite a bit of time on that side. What was that sound just then? There's another one down there. Okay. Cool. Whatever. Um, I definitely think I need to get into that place. I don't need much else. Oop! I didn't. I wanted to keep that. I think I'm gonna have to cut through. 
some things. So I actually get also prep because I'm gonna get my other other tool, my other pry bar. So I can already get my hammer. First run successful. First run not so so successful. That's actually feels quite like intimidating as well, I'm not gonna lie. Okay, push your luck. Sometimes it'll work out. Alright, let's get out of here. Bloody hell. Things give me bloody creeps. So I can even smash this one. Go. Impact hammer. Did I just equip it? So I need two gears. Go. Lovely. Plasma's all mine. Wait, that was only one plasma? I'm gonna go to plenty of other places, Anna. Can I craft the hand back? don't think I can. I, th I think it'd be in like tools or something anyway. Smash plasma, plasma generators for materials. Pretty much cleared this place out. Next place is... There. Uh,
Well, all those things, man. Ah, bitch. We have to have multiple trips because of this um, receiver here. and limit the amount of trips that we have to do. It's no plasma thing with this place, I don't think. Oh, my um, pry bar's done. Two point five K of whatever that is. Smash plasma generators, yep, recommended. Collect materials and craft replacement parts, yep. I just need to move a bit further forward, in fact. I don't even know what that was. Not what I wanted to do. Get out of here. 2.5k, whatever it is for this area. Oh, 
Oh. Plasma generators. Nice. Park up. I feel like I'm going to get shocked, Tana. You're a bit... You got a bit of damage from that. I need to park a bit further away next time. Yeah, I need to park a bit further away next time. Lesson learned. Spark Tower. Sprint it! Bosh. Nobody has to know. Whoa. What is this? Okay. It looks like a do not touch kind of thing to me. Not going to lie. I very much do not touch. What was this? Whatever. Why can't I have oh it cups? Why can't I have both of them on at the same time? Hmm? I can do a headlight now. Look at the radio tower. Go for the cosmetics. Let me in. Next place that we're stopping off at. Well, probably here. Let's go around the bend. Yep. Bit hold on tight, kids. It's gonna be a bumpy ride. One second. What was that? That looked like shiny. It looks like a flower. Never mind. Looks like we're good to approach this place. I don't see that bugger over there. has already been looted this one
try and not miss anything, shall we? I prefer not to have to make multiple runs. That might not be a choice, in fact. Might just have enough storage space in our on our stuff, on ourselves to be able to do it. Yeah, we got we got more than enough. We've got every, oop, almost got everything. Right there we go. Store all that. Lovely. Looks like we're getting a sizable war chest already. I'm loving it. It's back in care. So we just went here, and if we go a bit further along. What's this? Abilities, car abilities. Okay, looks like it works then. Okay, go around this way then instead. I could get caught if I went. Go on, them. Lovely, making it nice and lovely. Let's make our way through all the loot. This is, game's actually building up quite a nice bit of suspense, you know, with the um, the, f the unknown that he's got going on for me. Like those things, they look they don't look like that active or whatnot, but the presence and the sound of them is like the constant reminder that they're there. Is a real nice atmosphere builder. I think that was a gas canister. Pressurized cartridges, yeah. Where are you? Right here. Ooh, it's a tree. Okay. Just 
Wait a little bit now and we'll see where he's going. Later, bitch. So the max carries is 20. Let's carry on down the road. Later, bitch. That radio station's up on a hill somewhere. Eyes to the horizon. Big Dan's. Impact Hammer. That's a nice juicy cable, but I can't take it with me for some reason. Not what I wanted to do. Use game, please. Right. Oh, there we go. I'll do that. Juice. Juice indeed. So I think this is the place, this is the last place at least. Am I meant to walk up the hill? Big Dan's. Okay. What are they? Are they people? I'm gonna take free fuel every time any every time I chance I get, man.
Okay. No worries. Just trying to take as much loot as we can from everything. Looks like this place has already been picked for the most part. I spoke, might have spoke too soon. Car door. It is a car door. Yep. I'm gonna have to build a new scrapper after this. Yep. Here we go. Steel sheet. Let's take care take of everything, man. Take it for everything that I can. You're full. Really no need for me to um take much else from you then. What's this? Steel sheet. I'm definitely wanna keep the steel sheets. I'm nearly full already. Right, where are we going? Is that my destination? Interesting. I need to go here. Oops. Could be really stupid. But I kind of want to know. And I also want the loot. Take the bump off of that. Might be able to get my own steel doors after this.
Hmm. That tire's buggered. What is that about? Don't worry, I'm. I know. I'm, I sort of know what I'm doing. I think. What is that thing? It's bugging the life out of me. I do want to stay here a minute because I want to see if I can get up to whatever that cross building is. That thing. But no, I'm going to go to the other building first because it looks like it'll be easier to get to. Is that a plasma thing? Yeah. Get close to this, does this disappear? No, it stays there, that's gonna be annoying. to get rid of that marker. They can hear you. That was a very profitable little um, thing. Let me out. This place is stacked. Or it was stacked until I took everything. Shame there's no socks. Never any socks. Well, that's the last building that we need to do up on this part of the area. I really want to go up top of here. Not what I wanted to do. Doesn't matter.
Let me back out. I've got some stuff to drop off in the um. Thing. You have to start crafting some sh In fact. I can only do crude doors. Damn. Oh. There we go. Crude headlights. Give me one. Oh, looks like it's possibly working now, which is good. I don't know what I just crashed into then. It looked like there was a path up to the top. Near where these tourists were. Oh wow. What is that thing? I need to go and check that out after I've got my loot itch sorted. Get back here. I'm rolling away, cheeky bleeder. I'm be busted by the time I'm done. I forgot to remove the um, waypoint as well. That's that's a bit annoying. Anchor plug. Anchor plug. Stop it. <laughs> Why is it not letting it go up? There we go. We've now completed the process of standardizing and replacing all the anchor mounts and infrastructure. These new mounts should be far more durable, steadfast against weather. Atmospheric changes and corrosion and resistance to any corrosion. It's been a lengthy and difficult process, marred by endless delays. It is my hope that most of these mounts will hold for at least 50 years, but many projections suggest two or even 300. That's far longer than many anchors themselves. What does it even what does it do though?
Okay. So there's stuff going on, but I'm not really sure what's going on. I'm losing health, though. Okay. I don't think that's anything for me to do right now. Let's get out of here, shall we? Stay away from that thing. Whatever it is. Alright, on we go. That's enough exploring. We've got only got this place left to go to. This place. Right. Remove waypoint. Turn on. And go. And we're off. I got a bit of loot up there, so it won a total waste, but... It was something, I guess. This is a storage unit. Order lies. Yeah, I thought so. I have to get used to not holding that down. That's fine. Stay there. Ooh, what is that? Battery jumper. Nice. Don't have to create one for myself now. Not what I meant to do. What even is this thing? A floor de de decal floral. Stop and smell the toxic fumes. Whatever. How do I equip this? Nice. They're buffs. Is, is, is it actually a buff? What is it? Whatever. Let's get him. There we go. Okay. That does bug it. Okay. Now you're just being a temperamental bitch, aren't you? That was useful.
Okay. I've really enjoyed this so far. It's like quite nice. But um, obviously it's like no. Obviously it's like the first mission, so it's like quite slow and letting you do what you want to do. And my my favorite thing to do is obviously is literally just to loot up everything that I can find. So this is scratching my itch perfectly. Oh uh, yeah, and just still not decided if I want to do this on when the game comes out. If I want to do this on rem controller or come here, or on um, mouse and key. Nice, my door's locking. Wait, what's... That's the way out. Let's go this way. Nice little floral panel pattern on the uh, bonnet. We'll change it out for some flames when we get it. If we get it. Around and round the merry go round. Do, 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 do. I'd say we're real. My loot. I will do, don't worry, I'm, but... I feel like there's loot to be had. Okay, fair enough. Maybe there's not loot to be had. Or not much of it, at least. It's not. Harvested from an old radio station, this broadcast transmitter has been tuned specifically to work with in the zone. Thank you. Time to get moving. The instability's ticking up by the second. But you can't get back the way you came. The instability makes all routes one way. And that's where my Octavice comes into play. It'll get you back to the garage, but it needs to be charged first. And to do that, you'll need anchors. Take a look at the Octavice display. It maps all anchors in the nearby area. Find an anchor and feed it to the Octavice to charge it. Uh, but don't you worry your pretty little head about how it works. You'll be out of here soon, so there's no reason to learn more about limb technology than you need to know. Okay, no need to worry, she said. No need to worry at all. Be careful, isn't it? Interesting that you can spin out. Check boot light is what it keeps telling me, but you know. We already know that that's not, you know, good. Look, I, I 
keep thinking. The way you're helping our friend here right now seems positively helpful. Right. Seems like me. You're looking to turn a new leaf or something? The only thing I want to look at is a 12-year-old whiskey. And the Respectable. Creature's head when I sent them packing. But isn't it worth taking a detour to run just a tiny little test? Can't think of a worse way to spend my time. Please. I've seen you manipulate waveforms with your right hand and knock back a double with your left. Or am I to understand you <laughs> lost your touch? What I'm understanding is that you won't shut the hell up until I test this remnant. <laughs> yep. Fine. Stop crowding my frequency. What? Wait. Really? Harpy, darling, you never give in this easily. What's what's going on? Francis? Uh, y yes? How have you not thrown him to the bunnies by now? <laughs> 80 years old and only getting sharper by the day. You're a legend. You're a role model. I'm giving you 10 seconds to get out of my... Okay, okay, uh, we're signing off. Hey, driver, good luck out there. Uh, and watch out for the bunnies. They are a doozy. The fuck are bunnies? Those anchors may look like glowing balls of magic, but it's limb tech through and through. Don't be scared. They haven't exploded in anyone's face. Recently. device is charged and ready. You'll use it to open a gateway back to the garage, but it will immediately collapse the stability around you. So only activate when you're absolutely ready to leave. You do not want to get caught in the storm that follows. That's fine. I'm, I'm ready to go. I should have really been looking at my rear mirror or something, should I? But, you know, these things... Looks like hot death, but it's so much better than getting scrambled by the instability. Drive into it. This seems like a bad idea. Whatever you say, crazy lady. I'm on my way. Ooh, almost spin out then, I think. Oh dear, what is that sound? Ouch. It's all good. Run away! I mean, spin out at the last second, that kind of annoying. I'm driving, I'm driving. Chill, chill, chill. Alright. <laughs> Pretty damn cool. Sure that gateway would. Hmm. Did I not mention that you're the first human I've sent through that thing? I mean, they've been rodents, but it's not like it's completely untested. But anyway, it worked. So, you should have made it back with everything you collected out there. That's the beauty of the gateway. It's the only way to get back with all your marbles intact. Now, take those parts you found into the back room. 
I'll let you use my fabrication station. For now. That station will concoct ways for you to rig up anything from roof racks to flare guns. Assembling an antenna with those parts you brought back should be easy as pie. But it requires anchor juice to work its magic, so bring back as many as you can. And just because I haven't used that garage in decades doesn't mean you can trash the place. Mess up my equipment and I'll throw you to the anomaly so quick you'll get whiplash. We clear? What do you want me to do? Assemble an antenna. What's this crew pin, crew bumper, scrap, handbrake? Oh, there's a hand bike. I need one of those. What was that about? In the paint shelf. Okay. So, wants me to deposit these... this thing, which is fine, I can do. It's a bit of a shame I can't deposit it straight from straight from my um, inventory, not my inventory, from my car's inventory, I have to do it elsewhere. Right, build the detailing station. On the roof. This roof? Yeah, this roof. Okay, let's go. Go. Ooh. Oh, look at that. Very nice. Build the detailing station to use cosmetic items. Where is the detailing station? Okay. Locked. Um. So I need the matter deconstructor first. So I need some. What's this? So I need some gears. Where am I meant to stick this? Ooh. Oh, this is just cool, man. This is so cool. Looks like a bloody star, like a homemade stargate. 
Yeah, beautiful. Get the handbrake. Okay. Space. Empty it where exactly? Not what I want to do. To help unload the dumpster, huh? Thank you for playing this preview. You won't be able to leave on your next drive, but you're free to explore the auto shop, the route planner, and take a spin on the test track behind the garage. Beautiful. So I can't go to the next place, but I, I can do something else. What's this do? Oops. Put this somewhere where I'm going to find it. So... There. There we go. Now let's pick up our... Um, stuff. Okay. Refill tank. Go. Panels, bolt doors, and bumpers installed. Oh, I've not got a sign panel here. Tires in good condition. I mean, yeah, that's fine. That's fine. That's fine. Let's um. Repair put a. A crew panel. Wash. Give it all a nice little new liquor um, fixer upper. I'm already out of repair goo. Okay, this is gonna. It's Interesting. Okay. Okay. 
I think we're all tickety boo now. Pack survival tools. What do you mean by survival tools? There we go, get rid of that, so I don't need it. Um Tires in good condition three. Aren't all my tires in good condition? No. Bummer. Evidently not, because it's telling you that they're not. Slot. There we go. Correct. Fix sealing kit. Okay. That's why it's not thinking because I need a sealing kit. Wait, is, that, is it one you one is it a one use thing? That's well, that's terrible. Almost essential items that allow mechanic to do their job. Okay. So I need a panel and I need I need a panel. Am I tripping? What's the other thing then? There we go. What am I missing? Panels, doors, and bumpers installed. One, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight. Is it the back door? Will I miss him? Maybe it is, maybe it isn't. Not entirely sure. Crude bumper. to pack? Is it meant to be a... a thing? It's gotta be like the back door but I, I don't think I've got a rear door. Yeah, I don't think I've got one of those those blueprints yet.
What am I missing to get the detailing station? It says I need more stable energy. This is where I get all my pro um, prototype prototypes from. Prototypes, all my um, upgrades and blueprints. Go. Reading a blueprint. Bulb. Thank you. What survival equipment do you want me to have? Survival tools. Survival tools. I guess it doesn't really matter. It's charged now, I think. A tungsten filament in case to blah blah blah. More light. That's fine. I don't think I need it though. Hmm. If I go to town, I can't do that. I can't go to town. So that's nothing really that we need to worry about there. Uh, yeah, we can't make this remnant verification a one and done thing. I'm sending you to visit Colossal Cappy. If that old anomaly doesn't induce electromagnetic resonance in your car, then we're free from Tobias's fever dreams and we can get you out of here. With that antenna fixed, you can now detect stabilized road junctions in the outer zone. You've got a stable route heading straight to Cappy's front door, but the energy readings are off the roof. I advise you not to take the zone lightly. You better gear up or you may not survive the trip. Which would make my life easier, so your call. Okay. I'll do. Oops. Oh well. It doesn't matter, does it? Does ni matter? Because we can't actually do much more. So, oh, we get a save for what it's worth. Or we'll save and exit. Because that is where we're going to end it. Not just for today, but for the foreseeable future until this game gets released. So, thank you for joining me. It's been a pleasure as always. Don't forget to like, a comment, and subscribe if you enjoy your content. And then, really subscribe by pressing on the little bell notification so you're notified every single time my content goes live. You want to keep up to date on my content related updates and don't forget to follow me on twitter which can be found in the description below alongside my paypal link so if you're in particular generous drop us a quick quid it'd be very much appreciated but otherwise thank you and signing off